Hi everybody, another day, another unboxing. I don't know if I'm gonna do uh, another video in Swedish. Maybe I will, I don't know, probably. Uh, today, another pair of shoes. Uh, this pair is also from uh, Soul Story. Since they are the only place where you can buy Jordans uh, in Sweden, from a Swedish uh, website. Sneakers and stuff. Uh, they are too worldwide now. So, Soul Story it is if you want, if you want to buy Jordans. So, these are the King Royals. I'm doing this without a microphone today to see how bad the sound is. Let me open this. These are the game Royal Air Jordan 1 Game Royal. And to my surprise, they sold out instantly. I really did not expect that. Uh, no, I really did not because this Saturday we got uh, the Air Jordan 3 Tinker with the black swoosh. We have the colorful uh, Air Max 97. I think there were something else hyped as well. So these were the least hyped shoes uh, that, that released this Saturday. But they sold out instantly. Uh, Soul Story sold out instantly. Uh, Nike sold out instantly. So yeah, the hype was a lot bigger than I expected. The shoes are very well packaged. And the reason why I bought them is because I love blue shoes. And uh, these, they're dirty as hell because yeah, well, guess why? I use my shoes. That's why they're dirty. But uh, these are blue, but they're too black for me. Uh, I love blue shoes, but they're too dark. And I think and I hope that the blue on uh, the Game Royals is uh, a lighter shade of blue. So let's see. We have souls in our soul. And the blue is actually, but they look cool, the blue is actually the same. And I'm not gonna beat around the bush. Uh, the reason why I like them uh, and why most of us like them is because they look very similar to the fragment, fragment ones. I'm not sure uh, if the color is the same as the fragment ones, but I think it is. So, um, a black tone on these would be great. And I think a lot of people that buy, that bought these shoes are gonna paint them themselves, do a custom fragment ones. Uh, but the color is the same. These are well used, they are dirty. Uh, and the leather are, are a lot softer on the royal blues, but I think the blue is the same. Yeah. Damn, those shoes are dirty. I have to clean them. Uh, so the blue are the same, as I said, but the white on these make the blue pop a lot more, and then we have a lot more of the blue. So if I compare it to these. We have all this in blue as well. So these classic shoe, you should have them. Uh, the leather quality is great, comfortable, blah, 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 blah. But for me, since I don't like black shoes, these are more black than, than they are blue. So um, yeah, black shoes. But these are really nice. White and blue. And I actually like them more than I thought I should. The quality isn't uh, any special at all. Uh, and 
I might think, you know, I'm saying against myself now, but uh, usually when it's not a retro colorway, the, the leather is okay. Still better than your stock Air Force Ones, but uh, not the same as uh, retro Jordans. So this is not a retro colorway, this is a new colorway. But the bread toes that I showed you last time, uh, that are a hybrid between two retros, the leather quality on those are excellent. And this isn't bad, not at all. Uh, soft leather uh, is good. It's not bad at all. It's just not like this, this leather. But if you're gonna wear your shoes a lot, uh, I think this leather is actually too soft. Uh, I like basketball shoes because I like the stability of them. And these are super dirty, but they are way too soft. Um, so even when I uh, tight, tighten up the laces, I still feel that they are too soft in a toe box. So I prefer I hate to say it, when I buy these shoes, when, when I smell the, the, the good quality and I feel the good quality, I feel, yeah, this is, this is worth the money. Like the bread toes, I really love the bread toes. Uh, so it feels better to buy shoes with exceptional good quality, of course. But if you're going to wear them and tear them and break them, I think this standard leather is uh, better. I think. I hate to admit it. What do you think? Do you like the super soft tumbled leather? Or do you like this standard leather? Keep in mind, it's not like the stock uh, Air Force Ones because that leather is plastic leather. That's crap. This is good. This is just good enough. And for the price, yeah, I think it's good enough. But most important is that the blue pops up a lot more uh, on these because of the white and because we have a lot more blue. So um, don't be like, oh, I, I already have those, I don't need those. It's not the same shoe, not at all. Not the leather quality, not the color at all. But I thought that the blue was gonna be um, lighter on these, lighter and brighter, but uh, it's the same. So, what do you think? Did you get them? Did you think they were going to sell out as quick as they did? Uh, are you gonna put on the blue laces or the black laces? I think the black laces. Uh, are you gonna do a fragment one customization? Customization, custom made um, of them. Do you like them? So I can show you both of the shoes. And I just decided that I'm not going to do uh, a video in Swedish. So, uh, Air Jordan 1, Game Royal. Uh, Royal Blue, White, uh, Standard White, no, uh, no Sailor or anything, Standard White and Black. And you get uh, Blue Laces and Black Laces. OG. So thanks to Soul Story um, for getting them. By the way, Soul Story is going to do raffles uh, from, from now on. So every Jordan release, or at least the hyped Jordan, the, the classic Jordan, retro Jordans, are going to be raffled out. So um, yeah, we have a tough time here in Sweden buying Jordans. We really do. So. Um, Thanks so long. And then guys, please share, subscribe, comment, most of all, subscribe. Thanks.